former Trump campaign manager Brad Parsale's wife, who ran screaming from their Florida mansion last week after a domestic incident, is now fully cooperating with police, according to a report. Candace Parsale, 41, initially downplayed the September 27 episode, during which an allegedly drunk Parsale threatened suicide and barricaded himself inside their Fort Lauderdale home. The wife told police at the scene she had suffered cuts and bruises in a physical altercation with her husband a few days before his meltdown. Two separate police reports described her acknowledging that her injuries came after the fight, according to but Candace Parsale later tried to walk back the accusation, telling Politico, the statements I made on Sunday have been misconstrued, let it be clear my husband was not violent towards me that day or any day prior. Police cited her remarks in a petition filed at Broward County Circuit Court Wednesday, asking permission from a judge to confiscate Parsale's stash of 11 shotguns, rifles and handguns. The police probe is ongoing, with officers from Fort Lauderdale's Investigations Bureau at the couple's home Thursday, where they talked with security guards outside the house for about 20 minutes, according to the Bureau investigates a broad range from crimes, from domestic abuse to financial crimes, but would not reveal what they were looking into. What is available to release and most important is, Mr. Parsale is being fully cooperative with the Fort Lauderdale Police Department, a police spokesman said. Parsale was released from Broward Health Medical Center Wednesday, and said he was stepping away from Trump's campaign due to overwhelming stress. He had been demoted in July as Trump's poll numbers lagged. Business Insider reported that Parsale told friends he was under federal investigation days before the meltdown. Neither he nor his wife have been seen at their house since Wednesday.